I did a lot of walking today, trying to find something that I could hunt. And uh, I didn't come up with anything. The acorns are all gone. And uh, it's, it's terrible. I'm, I'm uh, reduced to hunting creek crossings and flow areas and uh, areas and stuff like that. I mean, it's, it's bad. You know, it's a long walk in here. It's about a 40, 45 minute walk from where I'm at right now to the truck. I, I came on in here and crossed the creek and got over on the other side trying to find the, the best place that kind of brought all the deer together after they crossed or before they crossed. I walked it over for 15, 20, maybe 30 minutes trying to pick out the just right spot. Find that pine though, I got a tree at 3 o'clock. This deer across the creek on us, come stepping out. And I was already standing because it was getting late. It was 10 minutes after 5. And uh, she was walking broadside. And I said, well, you know, it ain't no use uh, trying to make a big deal out of this thing. Just go ahead and shoot her. This is a 210th deer I've killed with a bow. And uh, I just told myself, you know, just shoot the thing. Don't worry about aiming or looking or doing this and that. You shot this bow thousands and thousands of times. Just point it out and shoot it. And I, that's what I did. I was real relaxed. I was very comfortable. And uh, I just pointed it out and shot. And I made an absolute perfect shot. I hit a right back. And uh, Aaron went all the way through her and uh, she took off. It was a 15 yard shot. And uh, she took off. She run 40 yards and flipped. I watched her belly go up and she flipped one out. And, uh, I went ahead and climbed down right then because I had to, I got a long ways to go and I want to get this thing taken care of and get her on out of here.